New York State Audit here, back with another video. And we're at the New York State Education Department, located in Albany, New York. And as always, we're here to peacefully exercise our First Amendment right to record in public and publicly accessible areas. Look at how beautiful this building is. Just so you can see the detail of the architecture. So we're gonna make our way to the front, to the front entrance. But yeah, this building, the New York State Education Department is a department of New York State government responsible for the supervision for all public schools in New York and all standardized testing, as well as the production and administration of state tests and regents examinations. So they're in charge of all the public schools in New York State. So we're gonna make our way over to the entrance, head inside. Check the architecture of the inside. So far, the only sign I see is no smoking in this area. So let me give you a front shot. I'm gonna check this out. You can see how beautiful this is. Hey, so I'm gonna give you an outside shot. Of the surrounding area. Before we go inside. Take a look at a little more of the detail they have on this building. Beautiful building. So we are not allowed over here. Authorized personnel only beyond this point. And we have taken notice. <clears throat> All right. So let's enter. I'm not sure which one to pick. Let's pick the middle one. Oh, look at this. We're gonna take a look at that in a second. I'll just show you. Oh, this is beautiful. Yes, hi, how are you? I'm just taking a look around.
That's very nice. What does it say it is? Okay. Looks like it says an opportunity for every child. Uh, no, that's actually going to be my next stop. I was going to make it my first, but I found out that I got to go through like a different building in order to actually. Oh, right through the, you'll see the archways over here. You walk down so the you can so you, you can actually go through the <clears throat> excuse me the entrance of yeah, the of the capital. The state troopers are right there, and then you just go in there and just tell them. Oh, okay, yeah. So I guess somebody told me the wrong information. <laughs> yeah. What do you mean? Why? Uh, no, I was just going because they told me that I would have to go to uh, a different building or a different section in order to get to it. It was just. Oh. Uh, but, so right in that entrance and they'll guide you where you okay. gotta go. All right, awesome. Yeah, well, thanks for the information. Well, I mean, they, they do tours, too. Yeah, the, I've already spoke to a gentleman who, who works there, and, and he, yeah, he told me all about it, and it sounded good. I think he, I think he uh, fixes, like, the podiums okay. and stuff like that, so he's, he's one of those guys. It's like a 20-minute tour. It's not a long tour. Okay. It's, it's enough. All right, no, no. Yeah. Even though we don't do tours here anymore, they have the virtual tour online. So okay. Just go to Department of Education and look, up, uh, look it up. They have uh, virtual tours for the uh, whole building and everything. Awesome. All right. All right. Um, yeah, I just wanted to uh, take a look more around here. Um, this is the only area that the... Yeah, this is the only public area. Really? Wow, that's very disappointing. Yeah, COVID changed a lot. Yeah. Everything got locked up. Actually, it happened after 9-11. Really? That is very disappointing. COVID made it worse. Yeah, because... Uh, Am I on camera? Yeah, of course. Yeah, I'd rather not be. Uh, well, you shouldn't uh, work for in the public, you know, for the public, <laughs> unfortunately. Remember, you just said this is a public area, so. I don't mind. Yeah, sure it, my good side. It, uh, yeah, well, you, you always got a good side, in, in, in my opinion, you know, <laughs> until you show me otherwise. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, can I get your name, man? Uh, not 30 is my number. Th okay, so you can give me your, your number yeah. at least. Awesome. All right, cool. Thank you. All right, how about you? Do you mind uh, identifying yourself? Badge number is 50. Okay, what about your your personal, first name? Personal name and, and stuff. That's, that's, you, you, so my will right here. If I, 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 my supervisor. No, I don't want to. I don't want to. You don't no, need to just like. Not, just for advice, of someone's personal name. That's that. No, no, not badge. personal. No, that's. See, it's on your name badge right there. Mm -hmm. See what I mean? See. Mm -hmm. But I'm just saying. Gordel Thomas. Yep. See what I mean? That's not hard. You know what I mean? Like that's not that's not private information. I'm not sure why it's you would say comfortability. <laughs> oh, comfortability. But you work for security, man. Like you, you know what I mean? Like that doesn't even sound right. You know, you're supposed to take pride in identifying yourself. But uh, yeah, uh, I'm just gonna head out because there's nothing else to look at. Is that your boss by any chance, or? No, I mean, is that your boss, your supervisor? Uh, him or my... Uh, no, is that your supervisor? No, oh, okay, no, I'm just asking. So, excuse me, you mind if I just... You don't got a name tag or nothing like that, right? That is, okay, that just says you're number 30. Okay. Yeah, I just... I thought it was uh, last time I checked policy, but, you know, I only asked because you were talking to me. Oh, you do, um, you do audits and everything? No, I'm just visiting. Oh, you're just visiting? Yeah, I'm just visiting... Uh, you guys got a beautiful building? Yes, yeah, nice. Like or, or technically, like we have a beautiful building. Technically. Right. Built by the people for the people. Yeah, that's right. But yeah, I'm just visiting, man. You know, just documenting my experiment. Um, my experience. The, the no, I haven't even gotten to that yet. You know, I just, you know, because he spoke to me. You know what I mean? You saw I was doing my own thing before he spoke to me. That's pretty much it. And it's the same sign that's over there. But yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure, man, it's uh, I, your supervisor. I'm guessing your supervisor's coming, right? Yes. Okay, yeah, I didn't even ask for him, but that's cool. We, we can have, yeah, we can have a conversation. It, it goes back. Hey, good morning. If it's, if it's still morning, how are you? Uh, I, didn't, I didn't call for you. 
okay? I'm just here, you know, taking pictures of video of the building. That's all. And we were just having a cordial conversation, and I asked him uh, what his name was, and he just wouldn't give it to me. But he did, but he did give me... Uh, he, yeah, he, that's, he, that's obvious. <laughs> it's obvious to anyone. Well, in a public space, you mean? Because that's not true. And, and any, anywhere that's private or, you know, restricted area, then you're, you'd be accurate with that statement. But in a public area, he said it himself yes, that this is a... Like oh, so, so what you're saying is that you don't like being recorded. See, well, that's different, you know, because feelings and law are two different things. May I ask who I'm speaking to? Because you're the sergeant, right? I'm sorry, but I'm, I'm not going to... It's, it's okay. I'll just look at your uh, yeah, okay. Thomas Carson. Carson. Awesome. Got a nice, good-looking picture there. Yeah. Is there some particular reason you're doing this? Is there? Uh, oh, I explained it to them already. Well, could you explain it to me? And uh, yeah, of course. Badge number one. Actually, I would, I would have, but you, you wouldn't even identify yourself. So that's a little unprofessional. So I'm gonna not actually. Well, you said right here. Uh, well, it's right because here. you said you didn't want to because you don't like being filmed or we don't like being filmed forgive me if i'm not quoting you correctly but those uh, machines right there who are that for for the people t that work here yes yeah, access uh, access control yes. okay so it's, it's not for the public then okay yeah, this is not this is contrary to popular fiction this is not public this is an office so, oh, the fiction <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry this isn't this a so who co can come here just to speak to these gentlemen here just employees Oh, well, I have legitimate business here. Okay. And how do you know what business do I have? I don't know. So how right. can you say that? Because I, I have legitimate business. I didn't say you didn't okay. have legitimate business. But you see, I don't know if you have legitimate okay. business. Okay. Because you didn't well, my, state your business. Okay. Well, my apologies for the misunderstanding. Okay. Now, why are you here? What, what, like I said, I've already told them. I'm just, I just came in to visit. I'm just taking pictures of video of anything from the public area. Okay. Well, okay, fine. But, so... So yeah, I'm just gonna continue. Thank you. Like I said, I didn't call you. Uh, he, he called you. Oh, oh, actually, before I continue, can you tell me his name, please? Because he's failing to identify himself. I gave him my badge number. Yeah, but that's not enough. What if I wanted to file a complaint? I have, I have a right. I, it's not personal. Look, they got name tags. It's not personal. You have a name tag yourself. That's not personal. So I have a right to redress my grievances. Okay, so please give me his first name at least. I'm not asking for his first and last. First name, please. He's not. It just has a number on it. It doesn't say his name from what I see or from what I saw. Oh, if he doesn't want to give you his name, he doesn't. That's have not him. how it works, though. You guys, you guys work for the public. You guys are public servants. So whether you have contract or whether you're whatever the case may be, I have a right to file grievances. Well, yes, but he just said. He but how can I complain if, if I don't have his name? Well, he, well if you're recording this, you can uh, put it all on YouTube. Well, YouTube? This is not for YouTube. This is for, for me. This is for my per, my personal reasons. You you have a, a, a negative assumption of what I'm going to do with this. To, I was trying to be funny. <laughs> funny, okay. Well, I don't. I, I, to be honest, I, I don't mind joking around. I'm I'm, I'm very jokative myself. But in, in this moment, at this moment, I'm just trying to get his name, just so I can be on my way. Well, ask him yourself. He I can, he, get, he that's what I mean. But you but you're his supervisor, so you have to tell me. Why not? It's policy. I don't have to tell you okay, it, it's fine. I can it's tell fine. you to leave if you don't leave. If you don't buy one. But Actually, you, if, is, if you did tell me to leave, that'd be discrimination. You'd be violating my rights because how be because I have. How could, would I be discriminating? Because I have a right to be here. You, well, I, for what would you be your purpose to ask me to you leave? Right, if your legitimate reason. I, I do have right legitimate reason. I I just never explained it to you. Well, then why are you here? I, I would tell you if you it could seems just be like so. You're here to annoy people. <laughs> oh wow. I'm and sorry. You're accusing, look, you know, you're accusing me of discrimination. If you if you if you would ask this gentleman, I was just minding my own business, yeah. filming and taking pictures before he spoke to me. Okay. Uh, wow. Well, I, I don't I don't really know what's going on here. Why he's calling whoever he's calling? There's no situation other than the one that you guys are making. I'm not making any okay? situation. Okay. I'm just gonna walk away now. Why are you here. I'm gonna excuse me. <laughs> why are you I'm gonna here? walk away now uh, because you guys you don't want to give me his name, so you're not helping me. But, but thank you for your time. Well, he has a right to say he doesn't want to give you his name. If you say so, I'm not going to sit here and disagree with you because you're not going to you're not going to listen to me. Well, I didn't say I wasn't going to listen to you. But, but you, you haven't told me why you were here. But that's not the reason why he called you, is it? What was the reason why he called you? When a 
Because I ask him. See, you're, you're, you're being unprofessional and unreasonable. No, so I'm, I'm just going to, I'm going to actually, yeah. Yeah. So I can't really get the statue from this position. We'll have to, oh, there's some writing right here. So it looks like they called someone else. So, I don't know. Hello, how are you? Would you like to have a cordial conversation? Uh, Sir, you cannot turn a constitutionally protected activity into a crime. So you cannot ask me to leave just for filming. You were causing you disruption. No, I, sir, is that all you're doing? sir, how, you're being unfair. I mean, we could care can we, like, about you what? Want, I don't, hang out with your that's what I was doing. I, okay. Can you, can you, can we just please deescalate? Sir, can we please just deescalate so I can explain it to you? Sure. May I? That's what okay. I was asking you. He's being you, unreasonable. Okay. Okay. I, the way I'm talking right now is how I was. You see how he's. Here. This is, see what I mean, sir. This is what I'm trying to say. Okay. I, I'm 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 being cordial with everyone here. Okay. okay? He's the only one, Mr. Carson, Carson. that keeps raising his voice, yeah. and it's just it's unprofessional. He. Well, you were accusing me of being a bigot or. Uh, wow. See a bigot. Or okay. or discrimination oh. or whatever. Look, I just want to have a hang I, here, I just hang out here, can, can, can I just please have the conversation because he's not allowing me now, to talk to you. May I ask who I'm speaking to, please? Is, is, if you're just here alone, just to instigate I'm not, something but can you just trouble? listen to me, sir? You really don't need that. Can I mean, you just no listen? Reason. But you're not even letting me speak, and that's not okay. unfair. Can I just but, can, can you identify yourself? Of course. Can you just first identify yourself for me, please? I just want to know who I'm speaking to. My name is Anthony. Anthony, nice to meet you, Anthony. Can I can I get your badge number, Daniel? I have no problem identifying myself either. I'm just trying to have a conversation with you. Okay. I came in. Why is he whispering that? <laughs> oh my God, he's being so unprofessional. I came in, okay. Sure. I was filming. Tell him I'm just talk to him, okay? I was. Thank you. I was filming the building, okay. I, I only the architecture of the building, okay. okay? This gentleman who, who would identify himself called me out, asked me what I was doing. I just told him exactly what I just told you that I'm just filming and taking pictures. I've yeah. never been. Excuse me. I've never been here before. Okay. 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 So. I'm having a conversation with both of them, because the other gentleman was here too. He's not here right now. I, I can't remember his name. Okay, so after the conversation, I asked him who I, who I was speaking to. That's all. Just normal. You know, he's he sh he should take pride in, in his position and what he does, and just give me his first name. I'm not asking for anything personal. You know what I mean? He's he's on he's working. You know, at the moment, and he he wouldn't do that. He just gave me his his ID number. Fine. So this is what happened. He asked if I wanted to supervisor. I told him, look, I don't want to make a big deal about this. I'm just going to continue doing what I'm doing. I just wanted your name, and that's it. So he made the choice to call you, or to call him. Excuse me. He called him. He came over. I explained the same thing, but he, as you can tell, he's being a little hot-headed, and he's just not listening to me. You know, so I walked okay. away. What that's all. What can we do for you? All you want to do is just film Yeah, Martin. that's all. You know, okay. I, I asked well, him what we'll I was doing. How about you? That's fine. Okay. okay. But all I'm saying is... Because I didn't it, come here to do anything, sir. What it seems to me is that you're just coming in just to instigate something so it that seems you can go to you? viral on YouTube or something wow. like that. Because that's, we, we know you know. Like, but if you want to hang out mm. here, that's fine. Go ahead. Keep going. Okay. That's it. I'm okay. asking you what it is that I can do for you other than Nothing. That. Like, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not the one who so called you, sir. just that you want to hang out and, and photograph stuff. I'm, I didn't say anything about hanging out. I just came stay, in. As long as you stay I told him that. I said, I told him I wasn't going in any unrestricted, excuse me, restricted areas. Perfect. You know, like, can I... I, can I get some complaint forms, please, so gonna, while I'm we're here? Leave it at that. No, I, no, no, no. Actually, I, I would like some complaint forms, please. We don't have complaint forms. So where do I go? You can write the New York State Education Department. Can you write that down for me, please? 
I'm, my memory is not that good. You see, I could even remember his name, right? The other gentleman's name or his. But right? this is what I mean. So, you're continuing to just to keep pushing. Because wow. you're, you're trying to start something. So no, I'm not. I just want to. I just want to get this information. Problem, look. And, and, no, you didn't. Actually, you I, I, I have. Until you have something. That's no, you no, I sir. Already, Look, I can, tell can you just around. please de-escalate the situation and it just? Is no, it's not you because you're. To you're it further. No. That's the thing. Do I not have a right we, to address my grievances? Do I not? Can I just get the? Please write it down for me. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank you. Because I'm gonna do this, and then you're gonna find something else that you want to continue. No, no, we're done. This is it. Oh. Wow. Okay. If you say so, man. I'm not sure what the hostility is here. You know, citizens should be able to just come in. I was trying to ask you a question and you wouldn't answer me. I did. I, I answered you. But and you know and you know why I said I wasn't gonna tell you? Because you wouldn't even identify yourself. But I told them, ask them. I, t I told them exactly that why I was here. Badge right here. But that's that doesn't okay. that's irrelevant. Okay, so that's it. That's why I wear it so people can identify. Okay, but you shouldn't be take pride in just you saying it verbally. Website and you can submit anything you'd like. Dude, there's Okay, New York State here. Education Department. So, so this is where I can go to do. I'm coming here for trouble. You know what? You, I don't. I'm. Gonna, I don't have. Yeah, please. That's smart. Okay. I'm just addressing. That's where we're at. Listen to your boss. It'd be smart. He's not my boss. Okay, listen to your partner. Excuse me. My apologies. I didn't mean to offend you. And I didn't mean to offend you either, sir. I am not. I don't know if I believe that, but it's okay. I, I, I have a right to tell you that. I don't know if I, if, if I, if I don't think that I believe it. I'm, in right, I'm entitled to my opinion. Can I, can I just say something? Of course, of course. You can say whatever you like. I'm a very reasonable person. I'm a very uh, friendly person. I, am, I don't get any hostile person. I'm not a monster person. So then why are you giving me such hostility when I was just minding my own business, just filming, sir? You know, like... At, at, at any point, at any at any point that I, you know, I didn't offend you or anything, right? I hope I hope I didn't, you know, because I because I wasn't trying to offend you, sir. You know, I was just trying to explain to you, you know, what. Well, and I'm trying to explain something to you, but you kept interrupting. Me. Well, because you, you because look at how you're being aggressive and and, and in your in your tone. You asked me a question, and I'm trying to answer the question. Um, okay. You understand me. Okay, I'm in a public area. If he doesn't want to walk away, that's not my fault. We're having a cordial conversation. I believe this is cordial, is it not? Yes. There you go. It's a cordial conversation. You know, look, I, I'm not saying that you're a bad person at all. Okay, and this encounter is not going to determine how I look at you. I'm not going to necessarily look at you in a negative or positive manner. Okay, I, I would hope not. You know, I, I, I'm just like I said. I was just. No problem, of course. There's no problem at all. You know, like I wouldn't even file a complaint because, to be honest, I I was gonna file a complaint. You know, but I, but I'm referring to you. You know, you you were a gentleman just now to me, and I, I I don't know if that was an apology, but I take that as an apology. No, I okay. I, mean, I just you know it's an explanation. I mean. Uh, okay. Well, I, like I said, I don't. I, mean, I'm, I don't think either of us are going to admit wrongdoing, so we're just come to an understanding. Well, I, I I'm a reasonable per a person, and I can admit when I am wrong. And in this case, I just don't. If you can tell me what I did wrong, then I'd be like, okay, whether I, you know, whether I agree or not. But in this case, all I did was just come in, ask him, and I was just filming. I didn't even point my camera towards them or anything, sir. Okay, I was just. I you guys have a beautiful building here. I say a lot about the building. One hundred. Yeah, nineteen twelve. That's I was. I was looking at that, and I did a little bit of research on on Google. You know, I didn't. I, I'm, I'm interested in the architecture that you guys have here and the history that you guys have here, not just the building, in, in Albany as well, you know? This uh, building here has the largest, uh, um, what's the word I'm thinking of, colonnade. Okay. Uh, you know, columns, so it's been in Ripley's movie or not. Yeah, yeah, I, yep, I'm familiar with that. But, but that's awesome, you know, like, like I said, you know, I just... I just wanted his name, and that's all it was. You know, only because he spoke to me. That that's it. You know, it, we weren't even at a point where I was going to complain or anything like that. I just, you know, I, I'm willing to give him my first name as well. You saw that I gave your partner uh, my first name. You know, I, my name is Daniel. I have no problem with that. You know, I have nothing to hide. You know, I'm just, I'm just here trying to enjoy myself. But he got something to hide because he wouldn't even give me his name. You know, like how much? That's his decision. But uh, you're his boss, though, right? Yes. Right. So I you. Can't 
Okay, but at, but can we talk about the policy then? Isn't it within your policy to identify yourself to the citizens when they ask you? Because well, last time I checked. I could tell him to give you his name, but if he doesn't give it, well then. Okay, so can you do that? Can you please just tell him to give me his name? So that way I know that, that he's just exactly he's just disrespecting you. Because right now he's you know he's just violating the policy because last time I checked you're required to. So so that's already one one thing he's breaking. So if you would be so kind, I just want to get his name. Okay, I no problem. No, it's, it's all right. It's all right. It seems like I'm going to keep getting the same answer, so it's okay. I'm not going to ask anymore. I understand. I'm not going to get his name. I'll just file a FOIA request. Uh, no, it's, no, of course not. I'm just going to file a FOIA request for his information and stuff like that. I'll just get it that way. But, yeah, thank you so much. I appreciate it. Uh, thank you for your time. So this is information where you can get information, but just not the people's information that work here, apparently. ID badges must be worn and properly displayed. All ID badges, huh? Interesting. Please see security guard for ID badge. Cool. So Office of Human Resources. So this is actually, we can get a hold of Human Resources to file a complaint about his conduct, that's right. Okay. <clears throat> Looks like that time says 3.30. Guys need to fix that. All right, so what do we have here? Cool. Guys got a nice little setup. So you see it's 11.45, but the clock is wrong. I can only assume that's a very old clock. Perfect. Let's get a better shot over here. All right, let's get a better shot of the statues. Well, too bad we can't get an up close look on the bell, but this is what I can show. All right. So let's get out of here. Have a good day, number 30. All right. One more surrounding view before we head out. So what I can say is that that was a letdown. I went and did my research on Google and I looked at some of the pictures they had up and I'm telling you, this place is beautiful on the inside, just immaculate. And I didn't even get to see it. You know, that's my thing. I love the architecture of buildings and the inside of out. 
outside of it. I love the, the history of buildings. And I can't even enjoy that. I can't even see what our tax dollars went to. I'm just disappointed. And the treatment in there, oh my God, everything was good. Until I start asking for names. Then it's a whole big thing that I'm trying to escalate things and make things an issue. Nobody, you know, nobody wants to identify themselves. Their security, they got contracts. I don't know if they're police officers with contracts, but either, either, or just security guards. But come on, now you're supposed to identify yourself. You know, last time I checked this in your policy, their policy to identify themselves, and they're not. They're called in, uh, the sergeants or whatever his title may be. And then he was just as bad as them. Like, wow. It's just ridiculous, man. And then his partner, which might be another sergeant, because he got really offended when I said his boss. But his, uh, his partner, you know, talking to me like, like I'm the issue. Like I'm the one who called him and I'm the one who's starting all this. And it doesn't make any sense at all. At least to me. You know, maybe it makes sense to them. But it, it was definitely a letdown. I'm definitely disappointed. Uh... I'm definitely going to be filing some complaints for sure on, on a couple of them for just the, just the experience, the whole experience, you know, especially that one guy, Carl, Carson Thomas, at least I know his first name, Thomas, at least Thomas is just, oh man, he try to, he want to sit there and try to redeem himself and stuff without even apologizing. Like, come on, man. You know, you treated me the way you treated me because that's how you treat people, period. But either way. You know, thank you guys for watching. You know, as always, I appreciate it. I was hoping that this experience was going to be better. But unfortunately, it wasn't. I wanted to show you how good it looked inside. But either way, if you guys like the video, smash the like button. Hit that share button so we can expose the good, the bad, and the ugly as always. Thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys next time.